Hello and welcome to Avoiding Big Brother. I've been searching around for further OSINT training to understand how the methodology can be used in realistic investigations. It has taken me a while and I was looking for a course that was either free or at a low price. And finally I have found what I've been looking for and I want to share it with you. I've shown you some of the tools and services that you can use with OSINT on the channel with quite a few videos posted about social media searches, Google searches, reverse image searches, people searches and more. But what I haven't been able to do is to show context. What I mean is how the tools could reveal information that would assist in a real life case, an investigation, such as an event that occurred like a murder or some kind of illegal activity. I've found this course that does exactly that. The course is just called Open Source Intelligence and it has been developed and offered by the Basel Institute on Governance. This is a Swiss not-for-profit organisation and the Institute is a counter-organisation against corruption and financial crime. I've logged into my student account off camera and this is the curriculum page where you can click on the links to each lesson. There are nine sessions which is each a stage of an investigation so you really need to take each session in order. You can study at your own pace. I completed this course in about two weeks. I have to say I really enjoyed it and I gave positive feedback to the Institute. So this course puts you in a realistic case situation. You'll be part of an investigation into a company that's been involved in illegal fishing. So you'll be given an assignment of gathering intelligence about two entities, the registered company and the asset involved with illegal fishing of endangered species, the boat that was seized by authorities. The course takes you right through from preparation, which includes setting up a virtual machine and browser for privacy and security. So after the planning and preparation stage, the course takes you through various searches, collecting information connected to the two entities. You'll learn how to use business registration records and Google searches, how to find information through DNS records using the viewdns.info site, something I've covered on the channel. You'll learn how to uncover information from the past using the Wayback Machine and cached pages. You'll learn how to use social media, in particular LinkedIn, as this is a business networking site. You'll learn how to perform image searches and you'll also learn how online communities can reveal information about a target. All of these sessions link the case together. You're adding information that is documented in a spreadsheet. From the information gathered at each stage, you piece together links between the two entities and other entities and individuals connected to the company and the boat. So the last session shows you how you would put this information together for a report. And not only that, it can show you how to create a visual graph of the interlinking entities and individuals connected with the illegal fishing company. I've completed the course myself and I really recommend this if you are looking for free training in OSINT. You'll get a certification on completion of the course, so perhaps this could go on your CV if you're looking for your first job in the field of OSINT. There are courses out there that cost hundreds or even thousands of dollars, which I think many will not be able to afford. So you might be like me and looking for free training wherever you can. This is by far the best course that I've seen offered for free. I will put a link in the description below that will take you to the course page on the Basel Institute on Governance website. I am thinking about creating my own OSINT course and I'll be very happy if I could get it as good as this free course. Okay, that's it for today. Thank you for watching.